Hey guys, welcome back. So in our last tutorial, we covered the update post part, which is one of the four basic database operations, CRUD. Today, we're going to cover the remove or delete post part. Let me just name it delete post. So here, all we do is we remove or delete a post based on the ID. So we make a database query, a MongoDB query, where we find the post by ID and remove it. So find by ID and and remove where our parameter is the query param which is the ID request.params.id and it will have a callback function where we get the error and the post object and if you get an error send me the error 500 error or else the default behavior should be this time we're not sending the the post object because we deleted it so let's just let's just send one boolean value so it will be a 200 status code and a boolean value would be deleted true so we're just gonna check if the deleted flag is true then we know that our post has been deleted successfully so let's register it uh, delete post all right now the next step is registering the route so for registering the route we would basically use the same old endpoint, the same endpoint like this, which basically takes an ID as a parameter, except we will just change this HTTP, HTTP uh, protocol. <laughs> Sorry, I got stuck there for a bit. So we just change the HTTP protocol to delete. And hence, we have the same old URL. We are utilizing the same old URL, except that we are we are the protocol that we are doing for this case is delete protocol not get not post we're using a delete protocol so let's start our server cd server oh, sorry node mon so we start our server and basically check our endpoint so our endpoint should look similar to something like this except that this is a delete call so let's check it out uh, oops wait got to change this function so we're making a delete call and the function the controller that function that we're calling is delete post so let's check it out and we received deleted equals true so we are done so we are basically done with the four basic endpoints CRUD, create, uh, read, update, delete. We cover two read endpoints. One is one is getting all of the posts and one is just getting one post by ID. So we're basically done with the endpoints. Now in the next tutorial, we're gonna be covering test, unit testing. Now this is what none of, like I would say a lot of videos don't cover this part. Like they tell you how to build an app, they tell you that you have to create endpoints and yeah, you're done. But then you're actually not done if you want to follow proper software engineering coding conventions. So in the next tutorial, stay tuned as I'm going to cover how to test all these endpoints using Mocha as our test runner and uh, should.js as our assertion library. Alright, so stay tuned and good luck.